being a producer, director, choreographer, and also one of the artists is definitely has its challenges. It's a lot on my plate. You know, Jolene has got such an amazing energy. She is uh, possessed like an uh, unbelievable energy on the stage and as a person, as a choreographer, as a dancer. Jelena, I see as being uh, very good at multitasking. It, it got pretty frantic, I have to say. Um, trying to direct, trying to choreograph, trying to um, work on the music, work on the, the storyline and the concept. Oh yeah, what about the costumes? So multitasking is a really important ability. I'm kind of used to it. I've done it for a long time. Worn those different hats, it does get overwhelming, but I do have, Heather is my, I could say my right hand. We, we make a great team. She helps me to direct when I need help directing or help with other tasks and in, in producing the show. So I definitely have help and I, I've also learned to delegate certain things. She just loves what she does and she's so driven and I wish I could have that energy. The, the passion for me comes from a lot of different places. I love to dance, I love music and I don't feel any fatigue or any pain as long as the music's playing. Often if the music turns down I, I start to feel like just like I want to collapse after 12 hours. Why do I dance? That's a good question. I first started doing it because my mom, uh, she asked me to take ballet when I was nine and I hated it because I felt like a sausage stuffed into pink tights. But I, I never thought I would be a full-time dancer. It was always going to be my hobby. Oh gosh, I don't know that I really had a choice. I, I feel like I was born into it. I really was my, my grandmother was a belly dancer and my mother was a belly dancer and she was dancing you know, while I was in the oven and um, I have never known anything different. I love dancing because it allows me to express myself and it gives me a creative outlet and it's also my form of meditation you might say and stress relief because when I'm dancing I'm completely in the moment and I'm not thinking about anything else. Yeah, I started dancing when I was like three and never stopped and I just always knew from, from when I was a little kid I knew that like this is what I was going to do when I grew up. Like there was never a doubt in my mind about it. I love it. I grew up around uh, Middle Eastern dancing and folk dancing, folk music. Uh, so I dance because it's the thing I love most in the world to do. I did, I started dancing at three and uh, continued <laughs> until now, <laughs> yeah. My dance background comes from um, jazz and hip hop, a little bit of ballet, uh, but I was really into hip hop. I was kind of obsessed with it, the way I am now with belly dance. People dance because they love to dance. They cannot live without dancing. Lucia is a very special person to me. She's one of my very best friends. Uh, when she performs in the show, it's breathtaking, her dance ability. She has a tremendous sense of humor. She will keep you laughing through the good times and the bad times. Stop it! <laughs> she's, she's a special artist because she, she's very passionate. She will rehearse her butt off until the dance is perfected. But she's, she sometimes needs a little tough love, but we have a great working relationship and she understands me and I understand her very, very well. I think she did a wonderful job. With a brave, she started this kind of show and, and, and I'm, I'm very, very happy. Like, I'm really happy and proud to be part of this project. It's a very unique project. For me, it's just, it's a drive, it's a passion. It's, the, it's, the, it's my breakfast, lunch, and dinner. It's the first thing I wake up thinking about in the morning. It's the last thing I think about when I go to sleep at night.